I hate golf. As far as I'm concerned, golf is the most boring sport known to man. Just try to watch it. Unless you fought that special over 80 demographic, you'll probably be sound asleep in minutes. As you can probably tell, this is a sport I'm not particularly fond of. But you know what is something I do quite enjoy? RPGs. I'm a particularly big fan of old school style ones. You know, your Final Fantasies, your Dragon Quest, your Chrono Triggers. So imagine my surprise when I found an RPG that was about golf. The sport of golf. The sport that I hate. But that genre that I love. We're talking about a game today that takes to take all the best aspects of a Final Fantasy type game and combine them with a Tiger Woods type game. And that's not even doing it justice. Because today on Stuff We Play, we're reviewing Golf Story for the Nintendo Switch. Welcome to Switch Sunday, where I talk about the Nintendo Switch, and apparently golf. And if that sounds cool to you, you should probably subscribe. And today we're talking about Golf Story, a game that I love so much that this is my third playthrough right here. Why do I like this game? What makes it so special and such a standout title? Well, we're going over that in today's video. Golf Story was released exclusively for the Nintendo Switch by Sidebar Games. This game follows a childhood prodigy golfer who, after having grown up and had a fair bit of bad luck along the way, decides to head back to Well Worn Grove, where he had practiced the sport of golf as a kid with his dad. He partakes in this journey in order to rekindle his love of sports, but before long, you find yourself on an adventure around the world. While initially this seems right out of a 90s sports film, you soon realize that the story here is surprisingly special. I know the game is called golf story, but hear me out here. Now, I knew going into this that this probably wouldn't just be a bunch of 18 hole courses for 12 hours or so, but the world here is filled with so many lovable characters, many who have quirks and desires of their own. I'd go as far to say that this game thematically is less about golf and more about trusting in yourself and others. This is not to downplay the golfing here, of course. It plays in the turn-based combat you'd expect to find in RPG style such as this. Instead, you partake in, well, the sport of golf. Like in most golf games, a three-point system is used here, in which you take aim, take wind into account, then time yourself with a power bar. As you complete more golf courses and the challenges within, you earn experience points, which can then be allotted to stats such as strength, ability, or even your ability to control the ball spin. You also earn cash, which you can use to buy upgraded equipment so you can play both smarter and harder. Presentation-wise, Golf Story is absolutely stunning. Though this particular graphical style, you know that 8 16-bit mesh is very common in indie games, Golf Story comes off as remarkably sharp, detailed, and original in its presentation. Every part of each course pops out and is a feast for the eyes. There's a lot of movement in Golf Story, and there's a lot going on in every course. However, it never becomes hard to follow or headache inducing. After all, this is golf we're talking about. Don't get me wrong, the game definitely has some tense moments. I mean, trust me, that first time when you're trying to play golf at the beginning of the game and there's the birds watching and your main character is nervous, you feel it. The music, on the other hand, I honestly found a bit forgettable. No piece really stayed with me after I set the game down. Honestly, I feel like Golf Story is a must own for every Nintendo Switch owner. I've talked about this game so much on the channel already, I think it's finally time I gave it a proper review such as this, even if this is a rather quick one. I mentioned this game first when I did my top 5 Nintendo Switch eShop games video last year. From its deep story, to its lovable characters, to its solid gameplay mechanics, Golf Story is not one to be missed, and at its price point, I think you're doing yourself a disservice by not giving this game a shot. But you know what? Perhaps I'm just starting to ramble a bit. Have you played Golf Story? Why don't you let me know your thoughts on it down in the comments section below? Or even better, why don't you give me suggestions for indie games to look at on the channel down there as well? And while you're at, why don't you subscribe to Stuff We Play for more great content like this? I like to say while you're at it a lot, I really have noticed that. Perhaps, I guess, while you're at it, give me some better transitioning words to use. But anyways, uh, thank you very much for watching. Stay classy, and I will see y'all next time.